shrines to the gods. Okay. Crack, crack, crack. So we find the temple down here. But the likely locations are up here. Hang on. Asteroid sighted. Our deep space tracking arrays on Antioch have made an alarming discovery. A large asteroid is heading for it. Situation oh, great. Updated. Uh, okay, you. Come up here. Now, where's this asteroid? Come destroy it. With extreme prejudice. As it slowly drifts towards my planet. It's not too far away. We can get there. Our fleet's already there. Situation log updated. Thor oh, will deal with this. Yeah, we've entered the Procyon system and its crew report that the stellar object, not unlike the shrine to the untold, is indeed orbiting the star. Construction complete. Come on, combat ships, get it. Oh, really? It appears that the crack team of administrators we sent to New Africa in order to set things straight have been turned. Fortunately for us, their plot to do as little work as possible was unsurprisingly sloppily executed and easily discovered. Heads will roll, metaphorically speaking, of course, as our last recourse is to depose the local government and manage the colony's affairs from the capital. It won't be pretty. Situation log updated. Okay, we found another shrine. It comes to defense fleet. Hostile fleet engaged. Blow up that asteroid. Log updated. Oh. And another shrine. I'm guessing we're meant to actually do research projects on them. We'll come back to that once we've dealt with this. He's so promising at destroying asteroids. We got some minerals out of it. How's their upgrade going? 5% left. Okay, science person. Where are you hiding at the moment? Come research that project. Then come research that project. System survey complete. Nah. We've got it. Okay. Let's put a hydroponics. And a hydroponics. And a hydroponics. And a hydroponics. We can always delete some of them later and we will upgrade that to a planetary administration. Other than the starvation, they really like us. How long do these guys are integrated? 200 months. Ships upgraded. Construction complete. Yay. All our ships just got upgraded. Benrear and Tier classes. Yeah, it's gone for the first set. So they'll be no good against smaller ships. Okay. 
does, however, mean I'm ready to go. Alright, let's put you next to that wormhole. And you next to that wormhole. Special project complete. Okay, deciphering the pictograms in a benefactress's shrine was a much smoother process than anticipated. All linguists involved describe the language quickly connecting or clicking in their minds, despite its age and complexity. However, the writings are unlikely to make much sense until they are combined with other writs associated with the rest of the Quadrumviat Godhead. Research complete. Naval capacity. Let's unlock Tundra Worlds. We've got a few of them laying around. Not that I've really got anyone to colonize them with. Research complete. Research alternatives. Okay. Hyperlane mapping would let me know where hyperlane people could jump, but eh, it's not that useful. Quantum destabilizer. Reduces the fire rate of ships. I don't really have fortresses and stuff. Anyway. I'm really inclined to ignore both of them, despite them being rare techs. Um, I'm going to go for this one. Get some better reactors for my ships. Okay, now we've sorted them out in terms of picking their traits and things. We can add them back to the sector. I don't have to worry about them. Where's that one? Anomaly found. Atmospheric readings from whatever that planet is, Duranima, do not match simulated projections. We'll find out why. Special project complete. Shrine to the Undaunted. After days of activities that can be best be termed fiddling, science officer, whatever his name is, I'm not even trying to pronounce that thing, jeez. Has retrieved the Doctrine of the Undaunted, a textile scroll coated with a sturdy plastic polymer. Yeah, you boys still at war. Yes, they are. So, I think that's a good time for us to dive in and kick some butt again. We will rationalize the Gorf. Okay, Hell's Blades will go for Skull. Ragnar's Wrath will go for a rat. And then the army will wait at Casper Dane. Okay, with an iron fist from afar, our remote government of New Africa is now firmly established. It has met with some success in suppressing the proliferation of the pollen-bearing plant Marin Karen, as well as in eroding the community's acceptance of using it. No small feat considering the act is an innocent as smelling a flower. Hostile fleet engaged. Situation log updated. Situation log updated. 
Uh, we've jumped straight in on their face and destroyed things already. Hostile fleet engaged. Situation log updated. Okay, swirling shadows. Immense ragged planes of shadow drift across Dorama's face. They are cast not by clouds, but by sheets of organic material drifting through the upper layers of the atmosphere, hinged or rather jointed to allow for a small degree of articulation. The science officer is unwilling yet to say what these things are flora or fauna, or what their purpose is. If any elaborate shadow casting might serve. Situation log updated. Situation log updated. And Ragnar's wrath is in. Bombard that place. Hostile fleet detected. Hostile fleet engaged. You crazy science ship. Updated. Hostile get, fleet detected. Get sniped. Okay. Hostile fleet. 6k. Heading for where? Neshmet system. Mithar system. Neither of the ones system I'm in. Survey complete. Special project complete. Okay, Shrine to the Percipient. Science officer has reported back the findings of the Percipient Shrine. They recognised early on that a text in some logographic script is inlaid in the walls, heavily distorted by the layers of translucent lacquer. Initial attempts at unscrambling the text relying on raw processing power of the computers to reconstruct the text from plain images proved fruitless, as it was simple, uh, simply too distorted to place in any known lingual family tree. Next, the crew of the ship attempted to bombarding the lacquer with light of varying wavelengths and intensity, but no beneficial reactions were observed. The scientists apparently considered physically separating the lacquer from the inlaid text, but realized that the strange glyphs would doubtlessly have been made misshapen to begin with, only to assume their proper shape when viewed correctly through the lens of the lacquer. The science officer was about to call the mission a failure when looking up the Irritably paced along the edges of the, oh, as they irritably paced along the edges of the circular chamber, they realised that discrete lines of keys of text were momentarily forming before their eyes, melting away only to be replaced by new lines. Not long after they had the ceiling, walls, and floor imaged in a spiral pattern, text from other shrines should help us piece it all together. And this is the old gods' revelation. The complete doctrine of the gods, for that is what the recovered texts have been regarded as, dwarfing the fairy tale scraps upon which the old human religions were founded. It's as shockingly revelatory as it is revolutionary. With only a little bit of creative interpretation, it is clear that the people of Midgard were meant for great things, guided by the strong hand of a religious leader. Our path to one is one to godhood, but our past is littered with prophecies unfulfilled and sin born of ignorance. Redemption is inferior. We could suppress them. Uh, we could monetize them. We could see what we can learn from this and get some society research. Or we can walk in the footsteps of the divine. Your native population gains the fanatic spiritualist and collectivist ethics. Sounds good to me. Hostile fleet detected. Let's have a look on Midgard now. Not all of them have got it. Hmm. Interesting. You're meant to be bombarding that. Land the armies. This is some strange pops. Collectivist, materialist. So they'll like the collectivist, but they won't like the materialist. Oh, that's a lot of troops. I 
brutally cut down by our valiant soldiers, though. Enemy planet secured. System survey complete. Anomaly found. Something moves with near purpose down on Gary No Ice One uh, C research. Okay, let's send you to whatever that place is called. Beige, something like that. Our military nearly healed. Good enough. Now, it's whether we can get enough war score just by bashing on the people we're trying to vassalize or whether we have to go for his friends. Hostile fleet engaged. Situation log updated. Oh, we just found all the science and... Not science. Um, construction vessels. Oh. One species native to Carinos 1C has, according to the VLS Cold World, orbiting the planet, achieved a tentative mastery of the planet. The science officer proposes that we should monitor their development closely and maybe even help them along if possible. Where's that? On C, that was this one. Irradiated Arctic preference. Time for another uplifting. We definitely don't have anything that's Arctic preference at the moment. We'll keep them Arctic. We'll put them on the Arctic world. And we will make them, again, rapid breeders. Situation log updated. Situation log updated. Where's our fleet? Oh, it's on its way. Situation log updated. Just blowing everything up. Here comes the military. Just have a quick check of my sectors. Any of you need power? Nope, but some of you need minerals. Down to the planet they go. Research complete. That's my advanced railgun. Advanced fighter wings. Ah, mineral processing plant. I've been waiting for that for a very long time. Enemy planet secured. Oh, my allies have just appeared. Good time to go jump the capital then. Marin, Karen, Slash and Burn. Our remote governance of New Africa continues to be a somewhat awkward but effective arrangement. The council in charge has allegedly secured the loyalty of a faction of our armed forces on the planet. Apparently they prefer staying indoors to breathing in the Marin Karen pollen. The remote government wishes to use these troops to mount an offensive on the flower. Having them erect atmospheric purifiers and wiping the plant from all urban areas entirely. Nice. All sorted then. Off to the new world. Special project complete. Uplift successful. We welcome them. Is 
that should let me colonize Arctic worlds once I have the technology for it, if I don't already. System survey complete. Got off to a rocky start. Despite our efforts, the soft shape of their psychology, they still occasionally struggle with the way we do things. Hostile fleet engaged. Situation log updated. Situation log updated. He's bashing down the planet. Situation log updated. These long range battleship shots pouring in. Hostile fleet detected. Hostile fleet detected. Okay, conscientious objectors. Nope, we're giving them the militarist ethic. Situation log updated. Alright, let's take them first to this planet. Re up my other army, or navy, whatever you want to call it, fleet. What's that? Hostile fleet detected. Ah, that's why that world costs so much. It's their capital. Stranger danger. According to reports, newly uplifted Olthonian citizens grow anxious as their human teachers bring up the likelihood of contact with as yet unknown entities from the far reaches of space. Um, I don't really want them to be xenophile or xenophobe, so I'll just go with I see. Hostile fleet detected. Hostile fleet detected. About to raid this planet now. There we go. Hostile fleet engaged. Enemy planet secured. Secured. Log updated. All right, embark. Now off to their capital world. Following this, we'll go to the other faction's capital world if we have to. Yes, I realise I've maxed out resources, but there's not too much I can do about it. Here come my transport ships. Hang on, who stopped bombarding the planet? Letting it repair, I mean, really. Hostile fleet detected. <laughs> That's fine. Now, this being their capital world, it should have a sizable combat force. a point. My second fleet probably doesn't have a commander. Nope. Let's assign one. Invasion. Upkeep. Regen and fire rate. Regen and fire rate. Self-healing armies. Or fleets even. Sold. System survey complete. Hostile fleet detected. 
Enemy planet secured. Okay. Let's get a construction ship. What's the closest? You're miles away. You're even further away. Let's get one up here. Build a wormhole station. Now, we'll send this science ship to come do all the research. The epic loots. Epic loots. Alright, they're repairing up nicely. Give them a minute. Research complete. Ah, mineral processing plants. Ooh. Eranthium forge. The sword can be refined into a metal that is both very malleable and durable. Excellent material for use in construction of ships and buildings. Ship hull points bonus. I kind of want the Gauss Cannon, but that's a good upgrade, and it, assuming we can find some of that resource. Being repaired. System survey complete. Oh, they're close enough. Let's go. came and built me a um, wormhole portal thingy so I don't have to. Gets us a new Batherium. Yes. Ooh, yes. Wish there was a colonizable planet on these three. Tundra, Tundra. Okay, jumping to the other faction's capital city, capital world. This could descend into chaos. Oh no, we've we've got a break. Nope. Okay, maybe it doesn't like us using allied jump gates. It thinks it should be able to, but it can't or something. And again, maybe not. I don't know. We'll Hostile put our own one in there. Detected. What's the worst that can happen? Hostile fleet detected. Ooh, a 6k enemy fleet.
Hostile fleet detected. All right, now there's a tomb world on here. Where is it? And how big is it? No, that's the continental. Arctic, which we should have sorted soon. Yeah, good. We just don't have the ability to actually colonize it yet. Is that the tomb world? Yep. So we could potentially build one of those. Come on, little guy, build. Build. We've got an invasion to finish. Hostile fleet detected. Hostile fleet detected. Anomaly found. Sensor profile of mid sized vessels briefly detected inside the upper atmosphere of the gas giant. Oh no, find research. Here he is. Hostile fleet detected. Hostile Looks like they're fleet detected. calling all of their fleets to their homeworld for a big brawl. This could be interesting. Oh no, they've given up. Well, that's a shame. Okay, gas giant ship. Active scans of, yeah, have picked up what appears to be a large ship deep inside the atmosphere of the gas giant. Judging by the nearby debris, there have been several failed attempts to salvage this derelict in the past. Any ship strong enough to withstand such crushing gravity must be a magnificent prize. And the science officer has proposed a salvage project of our own. Bring it up. Situation log updated. Where's our other science ship? Oh, he's already running around grabbing all of the... the loot. Yeah, let's recall the embassy. How long till you're done? 160 months. Debris analyzed. Thinking our science might be a little Special low. Complete. Ooh. In a masterful display of engineering, the team under the science officer has managed to great have gently raised the derelict ship on, on my ship, which is wrong, it should be the planet name, to the gas giant's upper atmosphere, despite its age. The ancient cruiser is in remarkably good condition, and we have restored power to its systems. No trace of the original crew remains, but we have brought over our own and commissioned the ship into the fleet. So I suddenly gain a new ship. Derelict class. Um, great. I mean, what is it? Is it a the cruiser? What's the rating on one of my cruisers? System survey complete. My cruisers of military power of 437, his is 128. I think we're upgrading that.
Debris analyzed. Alright, we've got a science ship with nothing better to do. Oh. Okay, hang on. Survey. 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 Thank you. So, I think that is probably a good time to bring this live stream to an end. I've got to go get some lunch. And uh, it's been a good progress. So we now have absorbed these guys. We're in the process of absorbing these. They are our vassals. They are our vassals. They are our vassals. Sorry, uh, they are our vassals. We've got to deal with the Hadashi Republic. And then it's start finding new people to fight. Jackley Confederation, maybe, or these guys. Are they in an alliance? Oh no, they're under the kingdom of Ganlago. So we're going to end up in a big brawl with these guys at some point. Should be good. <laughs>